Alright, let's mix things up a little bit. The, uh, whole situation with the railroad's already turning into a little bit of a grind. That's a bit of a... Every, every mission kind of just says, hey, go to that, go to another place and clear it out again. And it's kind of... Eh. I figured we'd go back, we'd go on with the main story again. Hunted, hunter slash hunted, travel to CIT. So we're down here at the closest place I know to the CIT. This Cambridge Campus Diner, where we're heading right down there. If I remember correctly, I, could, I might as well just review the text for it, but I believe we're trying to track down in, or bait out a specific enemy that can help us out. Road was instructing me to travel to the CIT ruins to see if I can pick up a signal from a courser using my Pip-Boy. There we go, so we're trying to we're trying to track a courser, which is something that we can use to try to... It's, I believe it's an enemy which you have to defeat in order to try to do take down, or uh, locate, and get a uh, transport into the, uh, the Institute. And I've gotten a little tired of Deacon, so I figured, hey, let's finally give Piper a shot. I've realized I've actually gone this far into the game without ever bringing her along for anything. I don't, I don't think I have anyway. We just met her at the, uh, Diamond City and that was it. Whoa. That whole truck started moving. That was weird. But yeah. So I'm finally bringing Piper along, because I figure if anyone wants to uncover the Institute... Well, a few characters do. A lot of... Turns out it's, uh, it's relevant to a lot of people's interests. But if there's any if there's any good time to bring her in, it's probably... Uh, this is probably the, the fitting enough time, since she's the one that actually writes an entire paper trying to uncover the Institute. Why are all of these cars moving around like ragdolls? That's weirding me out. Immediately, they're talking about how they need to cut down on the jet. You crazies. Hey, there you are. There you are. I was gonna pass them up, because I couldn't see them at first, but then they just went and popped right out in the obvious direction. Alright, I might as well take a look. One of those was legendary. Excuse me. Anyone else around? Maybe not. Exterminator's leather chest piece. Reduce damage from Meyer Lurks. I can carry something if you need not to. a big priority. It's not the not the number one not the, exactly the number one type of uh, modifier I want, but uh, I'll pick it up for now and stash it at least. If I ever know that I'm going to a giant base full of super high level Meyer Lurks or something like that, I guess I can put on some of those uh, executioners items we've been collecting. It's, it's not executioner, is it? Ex is it exterminator? It is exterminator. Oh, that's so. That's so. That's why I'm so disappointed every time I see that it has to do with Meyer Lurks. To keep misreading it as being ex executioner, which just sounds like a way cooler modifier for an item, whereas exterminator is just let's kill some bugs. Slightly less exhilarating. But that explains the the less than exciting effect that they do. I've been stockpiling a lot of the legendary items we find. Don't have a lot of use for most of them, but I my, there's no not much reason to scrap them necessarily. So they're just kind of sitting in, all in the stash. And if I ever feel the need to, I can outfit myself with certain outfits. But so far, I haven't felt much much need to yet. Let's deal with the CIT. I mentioned, I mentioned to progress the story since the last time, I believe, was when we went to the, uh, the nuclear wasteland. And met, uh... Met, met our uh, very mutated scientist friend with his hilarious glasses. Alright. We have a radio signal. Oh. We're doing the Batman thing. Well, you know, and other games, of course. 17. It's gonna- oh, it's going up faster than I thought it would. 19. It must be over here, then. 22. Oh yeah, we're absolutely doing the thing in, like, Arkham City and stuff like that for you. Slowly trace something. It's definitely more diagonal. Oh, yeah. What? Oh! Don't mind me. Don't mind me. Buddy? What the hell was that? Now stick your head back out. It was really useful for the whole murder thing. Oh, Just man. noise. Please don't hey. They said the jet would make you jittery. There we go. What? Someone there? We'll probably be seeing some more main missions for a while. Just to progress things a bit. Hello. Hey. There you go. Oh, hello. Something's out there. Something's out there? 
We gotta warn everybody. Oh, 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 Piper, Piper. That's not how stealth works. Ah, uh, oh, that's not how, that's not how sniping works either, apparently. Oh, I missed that one. There we go. Assholes. How many of you are there? What are you, some kind of encampment? Where are y'all's at? Yeah. Oh well, this is the forward, forward progress direction. Hello, hello you. Got him. I could loot them all for ammo and stim packs, but I, let's, I, I kind of feel like saving some time. 54. Let's go sprinting in this direction. Yeah, I want I want to give this story some more forward momentum for a while, so I think I'm going to focus on the main story for a bit. Just because I feel like things have stagnated a little bit without doing so. Oh, to go down? No. Nope. Not enough. Interesting we had, to set, we had to pick such a specific location to start. I guess we were working on someone else's represent, uh, recommendations. It's coming back this way. Is it going down again? It is going down again. I went past it, apparently. It must be in this pit. It, no, it's not. Good, because that pit seems pretty shitty. Yeah, I know. What, is it, is it in there? You in here? Maybe it's in this basement. It's co still going up. Now it's going down. So it must be above us, right? We must be taking in vertical height or something. Shit, 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 shit. Where's this one? Fuck me. Aren't those nuke? Aren't those suicide bombing, uh... Super mutants? Mole rat? Oh shit. That's officially weird. They take mole rats and cover them in mines? Things got weird. Okay. So it seems to get lower if I move from this spot, basically, so it must be on top of one of these buildings. Part of me imagines that this, the mole rat mine... Oh! Oh, it's getting higher again. Never mind. There we go. I was, I was totally misreading something. Oh yeah, it's getting excited. All hot and bothered. Are we still oh, we're going down again? Are you in this building? You look important. Are you important? Who's important? Yes, you are. All right, let's go kill the courser. I'm sure we'll be fine and not dead. Crouching time. So what does a courser look like? Is it just a synth person? A lot of dead in here. Somewhere around here. Yeah. The gunners really have bad luck, don't they? Every time I find these guys, it seems like they're wiped out. Must be a way upstairs. There we go. Because the front stairs were collapsed. Where you at, buddy? What a coincidence. Oh, those were... That's what, that wasn't someone sending me a helpful message, was it? That was the, uh... That was the existing gunners going after the courser. And by extension, uh, they're gonna be going after me. Hello. They're having a big mess over there. Oh, hello. Alright, a little hard to shoot when you're moving. Pew! Oh my god. There we go. Oh, hello you. No t no turrets today, okay? Who else is around here? Oh, hello. Oh, that guy had a name. <laughs> I mean, they all had names once. I hope. Oh, Jesus. That one caught my best prize. That was, that was a proper time to rapid switch between weapons. They're just coming across as rude now. Is there one up there? Hey, oh, shit. Wall turrets. Keep an eye out for more of those. This place is defended. Am I just making... Am I just making this whole job easier for the courser now by doing this? It's conceivable. 
What's back here? Some sweet vodka. Okay, I'm sorry, everybody. I'll go ahead and turn that off. It's probably getting annoying, isn't it? <laughs> probably let that run for a little too long. I don't know, part of it gave me the sense of like, oh, we're tracking somebody. Though, Gunner. Oh, maybe he didn't have a name. Was that was that the body? Gunner. Gunner. Oops, I picked up a pistol I don't care about. Yeah, for some reason I thought his name was Fletcher or something like that. Hello. Like in a certain other game I'm playing. But I seem to be just projecting names into this game. Let's see. I admittedly haven't been doing the settlement building very much. Uh, I did it a lot more early on, and it's like, oh, that's kind of exciting, but then there's like, yeah, do it for 12 more bases. And also, it has, I don't know, it seems to have very minimal impact on the game in many ways. Hello. Let's get this over with, shall we? Are you kidding me? Let's rock! What are you guys doing? I'm right here. <laughs> that was an interesting moment. They ran up to me and then were like, ah, eh, we could shoot him, or we could like turn around and go the other way. I mean, I know I'm in stealth mode, but they were literally staring directly at me in a well-lit hallway. That was... Am I invisible? <laughs> I don't have chameleon armor. This isn't exactly Operation Anchorage. Oh yeah, you like lockpicking, don't you? I think you do. Did Piper like Got that? It. Oh, maybe not. Yep, Piper liked that. That's how you work on that one. But yeah, the, uh, as far as I can tell, the, uh, the base building stuff largely feels like it might be something that only really matters if you just really just want something to do with your time, basically. Uh, at least on this difficulty. On the maximum difficulty, it might be a, some sort of useful source of resources, maybe? But for the most part, it's just a bunch of settlements that I can play mini games at to make people happy and then feel like I'm building something. Which was novel for a while, but I think I'm losing interest in that mechanic. Because I haven't exactly been visiting a lot. Hey, friend. Oh, a legendary gunner. You get extra attention. Bye! Special slow-mo. Alright, what'd you get? Troubleshooter, raider, right leg. There we go. But yeah, I, th I think when I, uh... I think more or less what happened is I built my base that I made for, uh... There's a, to there's a phone in the toilet. I built the base that I made for the Starlight Diner. Was it Starlight Diner? No, the uh, the drive-in. Yeah. And I was really satisfied with what I built there. And then I was like, alright, I'm satisfied. And then I, after that I was like, eh, I don't really want to do it again, though. Who? At some, I think at some point I hit the point where I just kind of want to go back to uh, Minecraft instead, by comparison. Instead of uh, continually building in this game. Technical document. Sweet. At some point, I should probably turn those in before I potentially piss off the Brotherhood of Steel and they don't accept them anymore. Granted, I may never use the currency I'm getting from them. Perfect. Surgical journey. Bonus limb damage. I'll absolutely take that. Hey, baddies. Telephone. What the? Oh. This is really awkward. Hang on a second. Oh god, I ah, missed that missed that twice, huh? That's all right. Vats can see through clouds of fire and smoke and stuff. Oh, you doing all right, Piper? You're looking a little chod. Lou, I'm trying to slightly speed up by just mostly picking up uh, basically ammo and stim packs and drugs, and then moving on. Just because this, this game obviously can sp let, let you spend almost infinite time looting random scrap for building resources. But I think I'm... I think my patience is slowly wearing more thin for that. If I ever get a mission where I'm like, Ooh, I really want this specific upgrade! Alright, I need these resources, then I'll suddenly be really interested in, in uh, hunting for that specific thing. Well, there's a classic. But until then, I'm just gonna try not to r fill up my inventory all the time. Ammo. It's definitely a bummer whenever I have to stop to clear it out. Let's see. 
I find it interesting that people criticize me for using the dialogue mod because that's apparently something that's... It, because it because it modifies the game in any way, that's apparently a cheat. But, uh, they have no problem with me altering the FOV, which also is, is using... That's also outside of what you're allowed to do in the game normally. That explosion effect. Weird. Oopsie. No! No! No rocket launchers. Bad. Shame on you. Here we go. Who's the nasty over here? And where is this where is this uh guy we're actually hunting? That's the interesting thing here, is that there's someone we're here to to go after that somehow what are they, are they behind all these guys somehow? How'd they get there? Must have cloaking technology or something? Getting curious about that. We've lost contact with sectors two Definitely and should four. be auto-saving. I mean, definitely should be quick saving here and there just to avoid the the fact that that happened. The freaking oh look, someone's pointing a rocket launcher at me. That's gonna end poorly for me. Cigarettes. I got you. Ooh, it's the chosen one. Yes. The door you open without actually rotating in any way. That's always satisfying. Always satisfying. Anything in here? I need to stop picking up typewriters. I need to stop that. Ugh. Oh shit. Piper, you get floored? I, oh, right, I don't set off traps, so she only she can. Oh, look at these guys. There we go. Let's make Piper happy. You meet her early on, and they gave her a lot of personality, so she probably has a, uh, a quest of her own, just like Nick. Nice. So may as well lockpick one, given the opportunity. Gotta stop picking up this la expensive lab and equipment, I'm contradicting myself. What am I doing? Alright. There's an excessive quantity of corpses around here. Like, if you wanted ammo for some of your guns, going through a pre-massacred gunner uh, encampment seems to be the way to go. Valid strategy. Alright. Wow, there's more up here. Here we go. Hey. Hey! Oh! Awkward. You were really supposed to die the first time. <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> we just had a moment there. <laughs> I'm sorry, but did you just pick him up and slam him head first? Piper can, Piper can just do that? Oopsie. Did not expect that to be part of her resume. By the way, professional wrestler, no biggie. Just a thing I like to do on Sundays. Hello, missiles. Don't want those being in the wrong hands. It is somewhat tempting just to pick a direction, load up a fat man, and just fire that missile somewhere in this building and be like, eh, well, I probably got like half of them, right? Assuming it goes through walls and all that. Maybe it doesn't. That'd be a, that'd be a bummer. I definitely find the premise amusing, like, what if you could just clear an entire building with, like, one, uh, nuclear missile? I mean, that's more or less why the, uh... It's kind of why they make those missiles in the first place, right? Not a whole lot going on here. Cigarettes in the no oop, hello. Ammo. Alrighty. Oh, that yep, that's the missile launcher guy. Few things going on around here. God damn, there's a lot of dead guys here. Too many dead guys. All right, terminal. That's probably for the uh, the turrets I already took out. What's in here? Dead end, I assume. Oh, oh, the other direction we could have gone in when I first found got here and and Piper did her sick wrestling moves. Hey, you. Awkward. There we go. Way better. Why didn't you help any of your buddies? Now you're dead and lonely. Maybe you should have thought about that one before. Yeah, we were like in the same room. You just you just kind of stood here. All right. It happens. Don't worry, I forgive you. <laughs> Any mines in here? Oop, my bad. All right. Where the baddie at? Oh. Oh. 
There are things going up around here. So those are just super scripted gunfights, I assume. Those must just be super scripted, because they they said they go off at such specific locate uh, specific spots. I doubt that it represents a real gunfight in, in any in any capacity. It's probably just random explosion effects that trigger in a specific sequence every time, which is kind of a bummer. But they're trying to they're trying to they're trying to establish that he's such a badass, that he's such a badass that there's that there's literally no gunshot sounds for minutes at a time. <laughs> Yeet! He took that bolt to the neck really well. There you go. Ow. Getting a little charred at the moment. Yeah, the, this, just the stretches of silence make the, uh... Kind of make the whole thing fall apart a little bit, don't they? Now where'd they get to? They're trying to have a massive, gunfighty, exciting moment. But the pacing gets thrown off by the fact that the game also wants you to kind of wander around and scavenge. You asshole. You hid behind a wall. I don't appreciate that. Noisy! It's my noisy gun! For noise! There we go. You're gonna be- if you're gonna run around like a crazy person, you just get the louder gun. It doesn't save you. It, you just die louder. That's the- I wonder if we're gonna intercept this- this, uh, girl that's being stolen. Are you overdue? Yes, you are. Still collecting those just in case. I keep saying I'm gonna look up to try to confirm whether they're u were useful for anything, but I haven't. At least I don't, oop, at least I don't think I have. May have for may have just forgotten. Whoa! Did I trigger that? No, maybe that was supposed to be triggered by the laser, so it just kind of fell down at that point, but wasn't going off. I'm surprised there's still traps around here to trigger. I guess the courser must be smart enough to step past them. On his tipsy toes. How many of you guys are in here, huh? Is it just you? Always on good oh, behavior. wow. Head came clear off, sailing through the air. Like a boss. Hey, you. There goes that. Light... Lot of nifty if you're gonna use here. a laser tripwire, it seems like a weird mistake to put it at like pretty much like eye level. Like, people are probably gonna see that. You should set it up where people aren't gonna catch it, like that first one that was relatively well hidden by comparison. So how does the liking system work? Like, if you if if Piker sees you lockpick enough times, she suddenly decides you're trustworthy enough to just like share her innermost secrets or personal mission with because you lockpicked a lot like <laughs> that's a weird way to increase trust yeah, I don't know if I could trust him but I didn't know if I could trust him until I saw him like open so many doors like so many doors and then he opened up my doors technical document another terminal there's a lot of terminals in here there's a density of terminals to the point where I'd rather not. Because I think I've already seen six in this building. That is a time investment. Hey guys! Oh, they seem friendly. And also that guy has my face. So we're gonna have to do something about that. Nope, Piper don't get in the way. I'm too busy being a badass. Oh, Piper. Ah, shucks. Guys? Can't we just talk about this? No? Pew! Oh, hello. Anyone else around? Like, right there, basically? Hey, you. I can still hit your torso! No, I can't. Abort. Line of sight, why are you such a tempty temptal mistress thing something? Hey you. Oh, how did I, I miss that one? That guardrail is just the the worst thing to happen to me, isn't it? Oh. There we go. And then things fell off. The end. 
Oh, all right, that faint beeping means that there's a spotlight pointing at me. Where is he? Where is you? Oop! <laughs> Nailed it. Get out of here. Stop your beeping, it's rude. Let's see. What's going on around? Not much. All right, well, that's a boring-ass room. Moving on. How do you feel about elevators, huh? You want to see me lockpick this elevator, Piper? Right Always there. Good behavior, aren't you? Are we? Are we? Are we having a conversation right now? This is a bad time. Didn't realize I had been. Always on good behavior, aren't you? What? Didn't realize I had been. So this is you not even trying, huh? I appreciate it. Too few folks can be bothered. Of course, in my experience, if you want to do real good, playing nice only gets you so far. I mean, look at Diamond City. A place I've been trying to warn of real danger. But every issue I publish, all I hear is, Oh, Piper, why don't you ever publish anything happy? Piper, why can't you write something nice for a change? It's enough to make me want to hang up my hat some days. Sounds like it must be exhausting. Huh, <laughs> no kidding. But people, they deserve to know the truth. Sure, it can be scary. Knowing what's really out there. <laughs> a night doesn't go by, I'm not afraid. Some institute drone will decide today's the day to pay old Piper and family a visit. But it's worth it. Because I know the truth. That's what protects us. Scared, huh? Could have fooled me. I'm pushy, not crazy. Honestly, these days I'm more scared for my sister. I don't know what I'd do if something happened to her. But I'm not the only one with something to lose. That's why people deserve to know what's out there, good or bad. You'd really risk your family like that? I'm not saying it's without its consequences. But in my experience, it's worth it. I've seen firsthand what the truth can do. My sister and I, we grew up way out in the Commonwealth. Tiny little settlement. Our dad, he was part of the local militia. <laughs> Keeping the raiders off our backs and the Mirelurks out of our latrines, as he'd describe it. Well, uh, one day, our dad turns up dead. His captain, asshole named Mayburn, claims raiders must have gotten him on watch. Well, I didn't buy it. I start making inquiries. Turns out, the captain, he'd sold out. Thought he wasn't getting paid enough to babysit the town. He was gonna leave the gates open one night. Let a group of raiders sack the place and take a cut of the profits. My dad found out and was gonna turn Mayburn in, but Mayburn got to him first. And I wasn't about to let that bastard get away with murder. I tried talking to the mayor, but he wouldn't listen. So, I papered the entire town in posters. Wanted for gross dereliction of duty, Captain Mayburn. The mayor sure wanted to talk after that. The town threw Mayburn out on his ass and were dug in when a very surprised group of raiders finally showed. Piper, you saved those people. No. Those people saved themselves. Because they knew the truth. But hey, I, I'm sorry if I've been rambling. I just get fired up sometimes. It's just nice to talk to someone who, who actually seems to get it, you know? So, should we head out? Alright, that had vaguely the same sort of feeling I got from, uh... Was it, like, the joke they do in Gremlins 2 where the, the girlfriend randomly starts telling this tragic backstory related to Christmas? It's actually making fun of the first movie when the same thing happens, but it's taken seriously. But, uh... That, we're in the middle of, like, a big gun-crazy expedition, and then suddenly we're getting sad backstories. Oh well. Bethesda! It's just their weird way of building RPGs. Context doesn't matter, just do, we'll do it right now in the middle of this giant gunfight where we're clearing out a whole building. Dark backstories. Character development. That's in better shape than I expected. Like I said, I lock picked the right <laughs> I picked the right number of locks and now she's just so into me. <laughs> it, that she has to just talk to me right now. This is master level? What's inside there? Are those two nukes or something, or energy packs? A little hard to see into the tables in there. 
What else is around here? I guess we'll just keep going. Nope, advanced. No problem. Except for that bobby pin, specifically. Kind of a problem for that bobby pin, but you know what? I'll find a way. Yes. There we go. Mentats and other things. What do we got in here? Test tubes. Uh, ooh, drugs, drugs, drugs. All them sweet drugs. Not actually that much going on in here, huh? Nope, just more med more us uh, uh, scientific supplies, which you know makes sense to lock that kind of stuff up. Keeping an eye out for traps. They they specifically like to put them on stairwells more than anything. Probably because they're good choke points, but also because the uh, the shape of a stairwell can make it harder to detect traps. All right, upstairs. I don't know the password. I'm telling the truth. I don't believe you are. Oh God, please, no, no, please, no. Please, please help me. no. You don't have to do this, please. He is right around here, and he's shooting people. He's shooting people for the password. Go ahead and quick save here. He's supposed to- oh, never mind. I was like, he's supposed to be right in here. That is a dead end. Oh, he's further upstairs. My bad. You. Come here. We're gonna have a civil conversation? Is that what's happening? Are you here? What? I thought- what? I thought we were having a conversation. Dick? Where the- This game likes invisible people, huh? Alright. Well, I thought we were gonna have a civil conversation, but I guess he just wants to be a dickhead. Fine by me. Where is he? There he is. Where you at? There he is. Oh! A little hard to make out. Oh, there we go. That gives me something to work with. Come on. There we go. Got him. That was a sneak attack? Interesting. Hey, asshole. I believe we have a... A courier chip. There we go. We... Yeah, <laughs> signal lost. I wonder, I wonder why. Okay, that happened. Hey, you guys. Friendly? Huh? He... He deserved to die. I know you're not here for me, but... I can't get out. Not on my own. I'm going to have to trust you to help me. Who are you? We'll talk once you open the door. I promise I won't run. The guard put the password in a toolbox. Over there, under the stairs. Use it to gain access to the terminal. And open the door. So this is who the courier was after, so it's, away from me. it's probably a good reason for me to help them then. It was by the stairs. Oh, here we go. Toolbox under the stairs. Password. A couple other things. If you're going to kill me, then do it. Excuse me. He... He deserved to die. I know you're not here for me, but... I can't get out. Not on my own. I'm going to have to trust Oh, he's, she's just gonna start over. I need to use the password. There we go. Turn the elevator on. There we go. Security door. Open. Here we go. We're gonna be civil? Piper, is this a good time? You, are you gonna sit down by the gunners? I don't know what to say. Seriously, Piper, Piper, don't don't just casually sit down by all the gunners that we've been shooting all day. They may not be friendly. Who are you? My institute designation is K198, but I prefer Jenny. So yes, I'm a synth. If you hadn't already guessed, I knew they'd send a courser. I just didn't think you'd find me so fast. I think I would have lost him too. But then I was captured by these mercenaries. And all this happened. Thanks again for your help. I'm gonna look for supplies before heading out. And before you ask, no, I don't need any more help. The Commonwealth is unforgiving. I need to make it on my own or 
I'm dead. Maybe we'll meet again, under better circumstances. I hope we do. Oh, no option to try to send them to the uh, r railroad or anything? You shut your mouth. Alright. Might as well open the elevator. What's up here? Is that K1? I thought you were leaving. She just came right back to the same spot. Weird. Fat. No, I'm over encumbered by a fat man. That's probably not picking up. Not worth picking up. Z247. Courser uniform. Interesting. Is a courser uniform? What? Um. Um, I don't have a pip. I stopped having a pit boy apparently. A uh, game that's kind of problematic for the whole thing where you need to drop items to stop being unable to move, and other things that ha come up. Hello, terminal. Hopefully that pit boy comes back. I guess. Jeez. Oh, there it is. Here we go. It's back now. Um, courser uniform. Oh, it's a full damage set. So it's not great for... It has some... It has stats, and so on. But at, unmodified, at least. It, I don't think it has high enough stats overall. 30 defense is not going to compete with the 116 I normally have. Nope. This just takes me right outside. Wow. Well, there's a site. There we go. Dumped some stuff on a piper so I could move on. What? I still can't move. What did I pick up that was so- Oh, the fat man's that heavy, huh? I don't freaking need this. I have so many of those already. It is too heavy of an item. That is a cool sight. So here's your proper horizon shot of, uh, of what Boston looks like. Wow. The tower sure stands out, doesn't it? Oh, there's a corpse up here. Full of shotguns. Alright, well, if I ever need a- if I ever need a fat man again, I know where to find it. There's a mire lurk way down there. What was that? That was me amusing myself. You'll get used to it. Or not, I don't know. I- I ain't a cop. <laughs> So we need to take that elevator back. Did she leave now, or is she still running around in circles like a crazy person? Oh, everyone else is gone. Yeah, that was a weird moment where that guy was like, Oh my god, we need to get out of here! And then he just immediately, uh... He, he, he uh... And the, 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 uh... The synth was talking about needing to get out of here, but then just sort of ran around in circles, then sort of started checking out the corner of the room for a while. Oh well. So, probably gonna cut the episode here, guys. I think next we're gonna... I think our next goal is to go get this analyzed, so I need to go find another, another location. Just gotta navigate my way back out of here. Oh, we're already there. Never mind. You think they designed this place with sniper fire in mind, or that was just a lucky coincidence? Wow, is that contextual dialogue that actually made sense? That's kind of cool. <laughs> Talking about the fact that I went through the whole thing with a sniper rifle and it was a giant open area that I could fight in. Yeah. That was very convenient for me, Piper. Good observation. I'll see you guys next time where we get this thing analyzed.